Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 18 player review on my channel. And in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 91 rated team of the group stage Kevin De Bruyne. So if you do want to go and pick this card up on PlayStation 4, he will cost you anywhere between 73,500 and 1.4 million coins. And the next box is slightly cheaper at 68,000 to 1.3 million coins. So looking at his in-game stats there, as you can see, he's got a lot of dark green stats, especially in, you know, the shooting, um, dribbling and a passing category. So getting to this guy's first pro now, what is his long shots? Now, hands down, this guy is the best long shot taker on the game. His long shots is honestly incredible. He has 90 long shots and I'm pretty sure he has around 90 shot power as well so those two things combined you know just making him an absolutely um you know crazy player at taking long shots so as you can see this is the first match now 14 minutes in he's already scored one long shot i play the ball to him again and the second shot i take in the game again it flies past the goalkeeper um so yeah this guy definitely has the best long shots on the game so you know when you're around the edge of the box maybe you know 20 25 yards out what you want to do you just want to take the long shot because um the majority of the times it will just fly into the net past the goalkeeper so the next pro after that I could find with him was his passing. Now both his short range and long range passing was incredible. Um, the amount of times you know on the counter attack where I just played the through ball um, perfectly to my striker was um, you know it happened quite a lot of the time just because his passing is that accurate. And as well as short passing, you know, he never really seems to fail um, at pa playing the ball, you know, short and interlinking with players on my team. So, yeah, another one of his pros is his passing. And then the final pro I could find with him was his ball control. Now, this guy's ball control is just as incredible. You know, from goal kicks, he can perfectly control the ball. Or if my goalie throws it out, you know, you just perfectly control the ball. And then he can either shoot or play the long pass, as I've already said. So, yeah, those are the pros I could find with him. Now, moving on to the cons, the first con I could find with him was his positioning. Um, sometimes on the attack, he does, he does seem to, you know, um, stay too far back, especially on counter-attacks, you know. Um, he's not really there making runs, you know, forward runs. He's usually just um, in his own half, just standing there, you know what. So that's not really the best, um, especially for your centre middle cam. And then the final con I could find with him was his um, work rate. And I think this is the reason his positioning is so bad, is due to his high, high work rates. So guys, this has been the review. If you have enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.